I mean, I don't know about you, but like I'm ready to go do something now. Like I'm ready to like leave and go like, I don't know, paint something. I'm not even a painter. Maybe there's a painter in the house to help me with that, but man, we are leaving with expectation. We are leaving hoping to send you out. You know, we've done three or four of these now, and every year our team has done this, there's been a comma. And when God birthed this and sometime in the 2011 era and we started praying towards it, and there's a whole story I don't want to get into, but he, he gave us four words through prayer and scripture reading and just abiding in him. He gave us these four words, the four words of what creativity should look like in our culture, what creativity should look like in the church. So we started with contagiousness, that it should move people to think differently, to see Jesus more clearly, but it starts with us being contagious creators made in his image. And when it's overflowing in us, we will be sent out ready to go point people to Jesus. And that was Salt 13. And Salt 14, we opened up the book of Nehemiah and studied the idea of collaboration, that creativity should be in the context of a team because even the Lone Ranger had Tonto. That ministry was never, be, never meant to be done in isolation and that we would lock arms with one another, not just in our own staff teams, not just between the pastor, tech guy, creative person, worship leader, which that's kind of a miracle in and of itself some days, right? But that we would also reach across the aisle and we would lock arms with the Big C Church, realize, realizing it's time for us to rebuild the creative walls of the church. And he's going to use cut bearers, which are you and I, the people who set the table to be launched to sort of dream new dreams and that was salt 14 and last year at salt 15 we gathered under this idea of uniqueness the third word uniqueness that god has planted something in each and every one of us in the room that i don't work at willow creek so nothing like this is going to look like bill hybels is crafting it and i'm not the guy who made cirque du soleil and so this isn't going to look like Cirque du Soleil. Not that that's what we're trying to go for. But the coolest part is the guy who did Cirque du Soleil is not Luke. Yeah, that's right. And it's not going to look like what I'm crafting, what God's crafting through me. And so I, just that uniqueness that God's pouring into you and sending you into your unique community with a unique team, with a unique vision to go do something in the most unique generation ever. Salt 15. And then we come here in that fourth word, excellence. A posture of the heart, not some pursuit of perfect. Four words, contagious, collaborative, unique, excellent. Your salt. And as he said, his Salt we think of as this collective whole, but you're gonna leave this place scattered. You're gonna go back to your communities and you're gonna be those individual crystals. And you're gonna flavor, you're gonna heal, you're gonna preserve the gospel in this day and age. And you're gonna help people thirst for Christ as you leave.